eFootball, formerly known as Pez, has just finished installing. So we're going to give it a go. How long are we going to play it? I don't know. It depends until I get sick of it and decide to uninstall the game. I can't imagine it'll be any more than 10 minutes. So every year I play Pez. Uh, I do a Master League. I put up polls. I let people vote on the Master League. I was going to do it again this year, but it turns out there isn't a Master League. Well, actually, there is a Master League, but you have to buy it. <laughs> the uh, the bad news is, the Master League is not going to be ready anytime soon. The good news is, guys, there is no fucking good news. This game is horrendous. I mean, they've, brought, they've showed trailers. They've showed, like, clips of Iniesta and Sergio Ramos, um, or, or PK even, training. But <laughs> in reality, a couple of players training on a pitch doesn't make a good game. I mean, you can see straight away from the graphics there, that it looks absolutely terrible. It looks like a PS2 game. I mean, it literally looks like PES, uh, PES 4 or PES 5. I'm actually not even joking. I recently played PES 5, and it actually looks the exact same as that. You've got this cursor around the, the player. Oh, look, any Esther went around him there. It must be the fucking greatest game ever. Like, what is happening? Why didn't they just st stick with PES? I mean, PES, it was never going to overtake FIFA, but it was a good alternative. It was a good number two. I enjoyed playing it. It was different from FIFA. I liked it. It was what it was, you know. But nah, they've totally changed it, and Konami have absolutely ruined the series now. Called eFootball, it appears they seem to be going in a direction of like just online, that's what they want to be focusing on. As for the release of this eFootball 2022, they did say that, don't get excited, essentially, don't get me wrong, I've never really got excited over a PES game in the last like 10, 15 years, but anyway, they say don't get excited. When this game comes out, it's initially going to be a basic, you know, dumbed down demo they said that but i mean there's demos and then there's there's atrocities and this one is definitely the latter so i mean past the move we've seen enough of this we're going to go and skip that and we're going to see what the game offers then so here you go welcome to eFootball 2022 35 gigabytes this takes to install 35 gigabytes for what to play a couple of shitty exhibition matches with like three teams you can choose from three teams i mean is that really worth the, uh, the, the gigabytes, the time it took me to install this, man. I think not. Now we're looking at a black screen. This is uh, very promising. I've got high hopes here. And you don't even get a menu, you just... Well, a very warm welcome to you on this <laughs> Look at that, you don't even get to pick teams. Right, okay. So you don't even get to pick a team, it just takes you into the match. And look at those graphics, man. Look at those fucking graphics. And people are saying this is a good game. Look how bad those players look. I mean, th this legit looks like PS2, and I feel like I'm being harsh on the PS2. They're now they're walking out in slow mo. I mean, Pete, this, is this supposed to be better than PES? Oh, eFootball, the way forward. I mean, look at the crowd, it's like cardboard cutouts. I mean, I know the crowd have never been the greatest things in games, but Jesus Christ, how can a game that came out in 2022 look like this? No wonder it was free. Who would pay to play this? I would pay not to play this. Jesus. Right, we're doing the Portuguese anthem, I guess. National Anthem, who cares, we're going to go ahead and skip that. And it's froze, I think it's froze, no. <laughs> the graphics look even worse in-game. Like, you see the wee cutscenes, the animations, you thought it was bad, now you start, <laughs> look at this shit. I mean, oh my god, we're playing at the back here. It's Argentina against Portugal, I think that's the only two teams in the game. I don't know when there'll be more teams added. I don't know if we'll have to pay for the teams or will they add free teams, but we'll just pass the ball there straight to the Ronaldo. Uh, could be in trouble here. No, we're not. That, that pass is almost as bad as this game. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Diego Jota there, giving the clap, but I mean, he doesn't deserve clap. He deserves punched in the heat after a pass like that. So I, I don't even know what I'm doing here, guys. I'm not going to play this full match. I'm just... Uh, right, play first goal wins. First shot on target wins. Man, maybe that. Right, first goal wins. Here we go. Right, let's do this. We're coming forward through... This guy, don't even know who it is, and we've won a free kick. So we'll take this. Actually, we've not won ourselves a free kick. We've, uh, <laughs> we've conceded a free kick. I don't quite understand how we've been given the yellow card there. Uh, Cancelo's been... We won the ball. We won the ball there, and they've given a free kick against us. So Interesting. But yeah, so far, what's your thoughts on this eFootball? Fantastic game, eh? Legendary game. Fuck me. I just, I cannot believe how bad it is. I don't want to sound like a broken record, but I mean, this game is seriously... I mean, look at this here. Look how bad the animations are. The running stance of whoever that is. We've cleared it. 
Played it to Gonzalez. Gonzalez. That's pretty much a full power pass and doesn't even get caught. <laughs> Gets to about the halfway line from the sideline. Unreal. Right, we're chasing down Ruben Diaz here. You know what? I said I'd play to the first goal, but I think we'll just play to half time. I, I can't play this game. Especially when there's FIFA. Not that FIFA's great, but I mean, it's still 100 times better than this. And this is coming from someone that's always been a bit of a Pez fan, so. They've totally, I don't know what they've done, but they've ruined the game. They've destroyed the Pez. I don't know if they can go back to the Pez franchise, or is it the damage too done? I don't know whether they'll. What I would like is for them to admit that this is a disaster, you know, and just cut their losses and be like, right, you know what, we apologise. Well, next year we'll bring back Pez, you know. I mean, that would be the right thing to do. Whether they do that or not, I mean, who knows? I know they said Pez is done, Pez is dead. The Rangers, the Rangers have done a Pez, or Pez have done a Rangers even. Pesco, FC, whatever you want to call it. But there's Ronaldo with the goal. We're dead, we're dead and buried. Argentina are losing here. A goal in the 19th minute, and I've had enough of this, guys. Look at these animations, these graphics. Fucking terrible. So, aye, that's it. There'll be no Master League this year for me. There'll be no my club. There'll be no random Pez fits. There'll be no Become a Legend series. There'll be nothing, unfortunately. So, anyone who enjoyed the Pez content over the years, I apologise. It's not my fault. And what do you expect me to do? Upload... You know, two fids a day, Argentina versus Mexico every single time. Or Argentina versus Portugal, whoever the fuck it is. Disaster. Disaster. Bring back Pez, 20, bring Pez 2023. Bring it back. Come on, get this game to fuck and bring back Pez. Because this game is going nowhere. I mean, what's the sales? I know it's free to buy, but it's free to download even. But, I mean, who, who's going to pay? I mean, look at this game. Look at the graphics. Look at the animation. Look at the gameplay. Who is going to pay money? To buy, even if they do bring it to Master League, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna get it. This game's shit. I'm not, I'm sorry, I'm not. Even if it was like two pound, even if the Master League was free, this game's so bad, I just wouldn't play it. You know, it's that simple. Anyway, guys, that's it. Let me know what you think down below. It's an absolute failure. eFootball, the fucking kilt pays. Aye, that's it. Pez is deed. eFootball deed. And who knows, lack of videos might kill my channel. Anyway, that's it. Till next time. Peace.